This time last year, I was invisible on search engines. Now I'm on the first page in the top of the search results for all of my major services. Today on The Shortcut, I'm giving you the tools that I use to go from invisible to the next big thing. Here's the problem. I needed traffic and I didn't want to pay for it. Paid ads are amazing for getting immediate results, but I didn't want to feed the ad machine forever. As a one-man army, I had to find an efficient way to take my views from basically zero to thousands per day. I chose my SEO tools wisely because I needed the most amount of impact for the least amount of effort. Here are the six tools that I use to get my pages to rank on search engines. If you want proof, just go to Google, type in freelance coach and see what comes up. I'll wait. Okay, now that we got that out of the way, it's obvious Google is a great way to gain visibility for your brand. It also saves thousands of dollars per month when you're ranked highly. It's totally worth the effort in the long run to really work on your SEO. And having the right tools makes all of the difference. Three of these tools are completely free and the other three I pay for. I only recommend tools that I use every single day. I simply wanna spread the word because so few people rank on Google search. Google only indexes about 5% of the internet, leaving your brand and my brand last year with the other 95% getting zero organic traffic. Let's dive right in. Before we do, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to turn on notifications for my next videos. Let's start with the free tools. The three free tools that I use, Google Analytics 4, Google Search Console, and Chat GPT. I use Google Analytics 4 to give me a basic overview of my traffic. It's packed with other features, but I only really use it to get a brief overview. I use Google Search Console to do two main things. The first is to see my daily impressions and whether they're trending up or down. The second is to index each page manually. You don't have to do this, but it seems to speed up the process of getting your content ranking on Google. If you have a brand new site, it's really important to manually index pages because Google can sometimes take months to get to them. With new sites, I've seen the difference between Google indexing a page within 48 hours and Google indexing a page within two or three months, all because you manually submitted the URL for indexing. It's really easy. I use ChatGPT as a basic ideas tool. I don't use it to write content because Google is currently looking at AI generated content as spam. And I don't wanna get all the hard work that I've done de-indexed off of the Google search engine. Clients hire me to help them rank on search engines. And one of the ways that I rank is writing content. My brain is small and the internet is huge. ChatGPT helps get the ball rolling for research. Now on to the paid tools. The three paid tools that I use are Grammarly, SEMrush, and Surfer SEO. I use Grammarly to write all of my first drafts. Grammarly is amazing because I can write as quickly as possible and not worry about grammar and typos. It automatically fixes and makes suggestions of what I should write instead. I write about 150,000 words per month and Grammarly makes it a lot less stressful writing this amount of content because I don't have to watch everything I type. Grammarly goes way beyond simple spell check. I use Surfer SEO to help me rank the content I've written on Google. I copy all the work that I've done on Grammarly and paste it right into Surfer SEO. Then Surfer SEO pumps out a list of words that I should add to the content that I've already written. I mix my first draft with all of the content suggestions that Surfer SEO gets me and it gives me a great way to rank on search. And the last tool I use every single day is SEMrush. SEMrush is just really one of those oh yeah tools that just gives you a good feeling to see the progress you're making. It gives me a great overall view of my progress and my ranking. It also helps me research competitors. All these tools combined save me thousands of dollars a month on advertising. These tools are a great investment for every single business and can fit any budget. It's really inexpensive to get these tools. And generally speaking, I've found that they pay for themselves within the first month of use. I'm Scott Luscombe, your freelancer and coach. Visit me at www.creatively.com and watch my next video to help you keep on growing.